And I'm seven problem solver Michael Schwartz trying to get answers for a Buffalo mother devastated after a priceless gift for her daughter got lost in the mail. They say a picture is worth a thousand words. For Jackie McAdory, there's no price to put on the two albums she made for each of her two daughters last year. They captured more than 40 years of memories with report cards and pictures of family members who have passed. The only copies she had. Parties that they had in school, all their little uh, grade school pictures. This album for her youngest daughter. The other sent to the oldest daughter who lives just outside Atlanta. McAdory sent the package from this post office on William Street in Buffalo to Lithonia, Georgia, but it never arrived. My package was labeled correctly. It was secured correctly. USPS tracking showed the album went from Buffalo to Pittsburgh to a sorting facility in Atlanta, Georgia on May 22nd of 2022. On the 26th, it was marked as arriving late before it was deemed lost. My first letter. McAdory contacted USPS for months and was later told her package actually never left Pennsylvania. How can they say one thing shows a package here and another thing shows the package there? Where is the package? USPS investigated for months, but in January, its Office of Consumer Advocate concluded the package was lost, stating from errors that occasionally occur. Because no insurance was purchased on the package, there was nothing else USPS said they could do. My life has been changed completely. I, I'm not the same because I feel I failed my daughter. USPS declined to comment on this situation. According to its website, mail that's undeliverable goes to the Mail Recovery Center in Atlanta, where staff try to find the right owner only if the package has a value of $25 or more. Packages valued under $25 are disposed or recycled. Someone at the post office has my daughter box. McAdory, though, hasn't given up hope, but says she won't be using USPS anymore. If I knew they were going to lose it, there's no way in the world I would have sent them my package. I would not have trusted them. A reminder to look at your options for your mail, from insurance to waiting, to see if it could be delivered in person. Michael Schwartz, 7 News Buffalo.